Alan Shedd with Touchstone Energy talking about how to save money and energy in your home. In a typical house, we'll find a, an entertainment system like this with a TV, a satellite box, a game console, DVD player. All of these, of course, use electricity while they're operating. I'm using something called a kilowatt meter to measure how much electricity these devices use. This meter is something you can either buy yourself for about 25, 30 bucks, or in many cases, you can borrow them from your local Touchstone Energy Cooperative or your local library and conduct your own tests around the house. As you can see, with all of these devices plugged in, we're using 117 watts of electricity. Let's turn each of the devices off in series and see what the total energy consumption drops to. So first, let's turn the TV off. All right, we can see that we've dropped now to 38 watts. So that TV was using most of that electricity. Next, let's turn off the satellite box and see what impact that has on our total energy use. Wow, no change. So even though we turned the switch off on the satellite box, our energy consumption didn't change. So it's still using power even though it switched off. Now the DVD player. Turning it off, a little bit of a change here. It's dropping 32 watts. And the game console is the last device that's on. We turn it off and energy use drops 20 watts. So we've turned everything off. We've turned off the TV, the satellite box, the DVD player, game console, everything, and we're still showing 20 watts of energy usage on our kilowatt meter. So these devices have what are called phantom loads. They're using electricity even though the power switch on the device is turned off, and that 20 watts is costing us about $20 a year in electricity for no real benefit. How do we combat that? simple way is to use a plug strip. If we plug all of the devices into a simple plug strip like this, by simply pressing the off button, we switch all of the devices off and we can see now on our kilowatt meter, energy use has dropped to zero. So we've, we've shut off those phantom loads and we're saving ourselves money. For more energy saving tips, go to togetherwesave.com.